This is my entry for the 2011 Spanner Christmas Challenge. Build a Meccano model using not more than 20 Meccano parts, excluding nuts, bolts, washers, spring clips and string. The clockwork motor spins the weight arm below once every 14.4 seconds. We can adjust the timing by changing the weight of the washers or the length of the string. The gearing here, 5 to 1 and 50 to 1, reduce the speed by a factor of 250. So it will take 3600 seconds for this shaft to turn. Exactly one hour. More gears reduce the speed by 3 to 1 to this shaft here and 4 to 1 to the hour hand here. That's a bolt fixed to this gear here. The minute hand is a long bolt fixed to a spring clip, fixed to another bolt, fixed to a spring clip fixed to the shaft at the bottom. The numerals are pairs of large washers clamped around the edge of the clock face. The six o'clock washer is mounted in a hole in the clock face so that the five o'clock and seven o'clock washers can steady the clock face against the base plate. The double angle strip is mounted onto the clockwork motor body by a pair of long bolts close together so that there's plenty of leeway for mating up the 50 tooth gear here with the worm behind. Originally I used a handrail coupling to join the plastic rod onto the vertical rod and then I realised I hadn't counted the motor in my 20 parts so I needed to win another part from somewhere so I had to take out the handrail coupling and then devise this way with spring clips to make a right angle joint between the two rods. It's quite firm and it does the job here. So there we are, a Meccano clockwork clock built from not more than 20 Meccano parts if you don't count the nuts, bolts, washers and spring clips or string.